the life cycle of the liver fluke. So how do liver flukes come to be? The life cycle of the liver fluke involves mammals, a water supply, aquatic plants, and snails. It requires two or more different hosts and has a free living larval stage in water. The liver fluke life cycle is complex. First, it infects the plants that are eaten by the fish. After the fish have eaten the plants, the liver fluke lays eggs inside of the fish. The eggs are released through the fish's feces and are then passed on to the snails. So how do liver flukes get to humans? During its life cycle, the liver fluke must develop in a particular type of small snails for two to three months before passing from the snail to the definitive host. So it's best not to add snails to aquaponic systems for algae control because of the risk of contracting liver flukes. It's recommended to always keep the water clean and free from snails. There are also other ways to prevent liver flukes, 